been made by Dio with our rod. Star Wars. Oh my god. This is not just a movie. It's not even a trilogy. It's not even a trilogy of trilogies, which is about, which I guess it's about to be with nine films. Not to mention uh, the trilogy of bad ones off to the side. I'm not even talking about the prequels at this point. I'm talking about Ewoks, droids, and the holiday special. Ooh. I guess in that point, we're going to have 12 Star Wars films by the end of it. And while my friends rant and rave about what side of the Force they lie on, what color their lightsabers are, and what Force powers they'd specialize in, I say screw it. I don't care about your lightsabers. I don't care about your Force chokes or your Force lightnings. Give me a set of badass armor, some Batman gadgets, and the will to survive. I want to be the armor-clad hunter on the edge of the wastes, Boba Fett. I want to be a Mandalorian hunter who can take down good guy and bad guy. I don't really care who, just so long as I'm getting paid. I don't care about this crap. I don't care about your little struggles, your balance of the force. I don't care about your qualms, Han Solo, about finding out if this hokey religion is real or not, or if you'll find true love. I identify with the dude who's got no magic, no morals, and at the end of the day has one job to do and does it so well that Darth Vader, Jabba the Hutt, a League of Bounty Hunters, and all the Skywalkers have to respect him for it. We're talking about a guy who, with one ship that he probably lives out of like a damn trucker, is one of the most influential side characters in all of Star Wars EU. And everyone kinda has to relate with him a little bit. Sure, you might not be able to relate with a light sword wielding super wizard that can electrocute people and throw people off the sides of buildings like Neo on steroids. You might not be able to identify with the smuggler who can make the Kessel Run in under whatever many parsecs just because he can navigate black hole fields faster than his contemporaries. You might not be able to understand the kid who can put together a pod racer and somehow navigate using his midichlorians magic to be able to get past his adversaries and claim victory for himself. But you know what you can probably identify with? A guy who's doing the best with what he has. A guy who's not a legend. A guy who's not an amazing, spectacular uh, paragon, nor is he some sort of maniacal mustache twirling villain. He's a guy with a gun. A guy with a quick wit. A bit of tech and a need to pay the bills. Boba Fett's incredible. Screw you haters, I don't even care. Give me that Mandalorian emblem tattooed on the back of my neck, throw me a gun, and watch me make some suckers bleed. Oh god, I love Boba Fett. Made by Dio with our rods.